y'all welcome and welcome back to my channel if you are new here hey make sure you subscribe and do all that good stuff um my name is venus i'm a little rusty with the intro but we gonna make it through if you are returning you already know what it is so um today we are going to be we're at the warehouse suite um hence the racks and kind of weird lighting and all that um to look over some inventory before this shot y'all saw a little montage that we did we went to one of my favorite coffee shops called brash um brash they have a couple of locations um the ones that i'm familiar with are on the west side so that's uh you know they got a couple locations girl um go ch check them out um i got a vanilla oat milk latte ice and alfred got a um what is it? Lemonade matcha. A lemonade matcha. So it looks like a, um, what is it like? What is it called? Rum punch? It's like a Bob Marley. Right? A Bob Marley. So if you go to Jamaica, like the way that they do it and layer it is really cute for the aesthetic. So you can get you a cute little picture before you have your little matcha. If you're a matcha girl, I like my coffee. I like to start off with that in the morning. I like matcha, but coffee going gonna do it for me every time. Anyway so um we thought that it would be cool to just kind of bring y'all on um in terms of talking about inventory we got we were starting to get our shipments in for the fall and winter and so we wanted to kind of bring y'all in to see how we kind of inspect inventory how we put into uh, shopify and then um how we inspect it and how we kind of store it so the next probably a couple of vlogs from now what we can do is show you you guys how we organize everything on the racks because right now it's the organization it went to it went to okay <laughs> um and i stopped being as organized so i need to come in here as the new stuff and we convert over to fall and winter from spring and summer i need to honestly get in here and just re we reorganize the racks so Anyway, today we are gonna open up this box. I got y'all sitting on the box right now and look at some of the inventory that came in for fall. I am so excited about it, y'all. I am. Anyway, let's get into this inventory. One of the things that's so funny to me, um, and like when I first started getting inventory, it was like, I was shocked. So if you, if this is like, you never order inventory, before um it comes in a box so our vendors are in la primarily and so they box it up and when i'm telling y'all they stuff everything into one box they stuff everything into a box okay and then they tape it up like this and so um if y'all ever go to the fashion district you can actually see all of the boxes that basically is getting prepared for shipment they look like this so anyway i'm about to bust this open i just want to show y'all like how it's all taped up and stuff like that it's hilarious to me um just because when i first saw that i was like okay how am i gonna get into this box Basically what y'all just saw me do is like oh open up the packs um but also pull out my the sample i always pull out at least one sample from each um 
like product or style I pull out one sample because obviously we have to do photo shoots for it um, right now I'm the, I'm the sole model uh, for the brand so I pull my size so that we can start to do the product shots and then we do lifestyle shots with every piece so that we can put it on Instagram Facebook email and also on the website so and we will take y'all, we're going to do a video to kind of show the process of that. Um, but that's what y'all just saw me do. Basically open up the pack, pull out from each style my samples um, that I will keep. And then now we are about to get, go through each piece and start putting them on these racks um, so that we can get ready to sell them. back home and get ready to go out to dinner at a place called Verdura. It's a new restaurant. I think it's like an African fusion restaurant that just opened in Atlanta. I'm kind of in a Piedmont area. So we are going to take y'all there, um, but it'll be in another vlog, but I'm getting ready to do that. But um, we went ahead and finished up all the inventory. Um, like I said, we didn't um, do any organization. Like we, I just put them kind of in their spots where I know where they're they're at once we start um, fulfilling orders and whatnot for them over the next couple of weeks as they drop. So um, there will be another vlog where I will show y'all how to actually organize inventory, whether you are doing it at home. Um, we started off in actually this room. This is my office, um, and it used to be blank blank wardrobe headquarters. Okay. <laughs> um, um, and we were just blessed and fortunate enough to be in a position to be able to um, upgrade to a warehouse suite um, where now it's separate from our home. And so there it, it comes with this challenges of organizing and things like that. So that deserves its own video. Today was just about how once you get inventory in, how to basically intake inventory. Um, people go through their different processes for us we get the inventory delivered to our warehouse suite once it gets there we start we open it up we check to see if it matches the invoice that you got so double check that because sometimes um the vendors i use are pretty good but i have had vendors where you don't get what you thought you ordered and so you want to check to make sure that it matches your invoice in addition to you want to check to make sure that there's no damages to it i've had several batches even from the ones from, from vendors that i actually really really love um where you know some of the stuff comes and it has some damages to it so you kind of want to nix that before it gets to your customer so that you can ensure that once you send a piece to a customer it's pretty much 100 percent quality guaranteed so it's a long process i don't know to be honest like what we're going to do when like we we are fulfilling thousands of orders a day you are hundreds you know of orders a day like i don't know what that's going to look like because obviously our inventory is going to increase however you know i think this process works for us now and we can build on it so um inspection to me is essential so we do that once we inspect it we go ahead and load it into shopify so um i can do another video on how to upload to shopify and some of the marketing aspects of it because um i don't do that at the same time so when we're in taking inventory the only thing that we're putting in shopify is the name of the actual piece of inventory um that the from the vendor so i don't name it a cute name at that point we're just putting it in 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 into shopify we put the quantities that we have we put the cost per item so that's not the cost like that the market price is literally just the cost that you paid in um shopify 
Um, then we weigh the items, put it in Shopify, and then that's it. So I save it as a drive so that I can go back once we're deciding on a release schedule. So I have a release schedule for each piece and then I go back and then I start the marketing pieces of it. And that includes like SEO and includes the renaming it to a SEO driven name, the description, the um, how to take care of it and all of the the pictures and all of that that i do that as a separate step so that i feel like helps me to be able to do a lot in a short period of time and also make sure that you have less room for error when i first started i would try to do all of that in one step and i almost always had some type of error because i'm rushing to get the product out when you separate it out this is something that I can give to an intern one day. Um, Alfred can do it. I can do it. And I don't have to worry about kind of the major pieces of how it's going to sell, which is like the SEO and some of the marketing aspects of it, um, which I can either do myself. And in the future, I can give to a marketer to do or a merchandiser to do. So anyway, all that to say. We put a process in place because it's all about scaling and growing and um, learning and making sure that eventually, you know, you'll be able to give that off to somebody else. And also it helps you to minimize errors. So, um, yeah, a lot of videos that we could do on inventory management, um, like I said, whether you're at home or you have a kind of like separate space that you work out of but yeah let me know if y'all have any questions i think we are going to close it like i said and then pick y'all back up when we go to dinner it's our whole new vlog on self-care um we got some good stuff planned for that vlog so stay tuned um for that one when it drops and in the meantime i'm gonna shoot it over to alfred he um bought some a mic chat some more tech and y'all y'all are gonna see alfred is into tech he is the reason why we have certain things um to basically do some of the marketing and content pieces of blank um because he he stays up on it so cameras lighting mics all of that he takes care of i don't really have to mess with i just know how to turn it on okay um, so anyway, I'm going to uh, shoot it over to him. So if y'all are interested, make sure y'all stay tuned for that in the next two seconds. But other than that, I enjoy hanging out with y'all today. I hope that y'all enjoyed it too. I love y'all. Um, and if you are new here, please subscribe and, and kick it with us. we got some great things happening coming up. Until next time, I will see y'all in the next video. And y'all, y'all, y'all say it. Y'all stay tuned with your boy. Go, go, go and stay in tune with, in tune. I got excited. In tune or stay tuned to stay tuned to your boy Alfred for um, the mic that he picked up. All right. Bye. What up, though? Today, we're going to talk about a little bit of the gear that we use to come up with the looks that we get that you see on our social media platforms and blankwardrobe.com. And for those of y'all that don't know, my name is Alfred and I shoot a lot of the content for Blank Wardrobe. So today we're going to talk about audio and uh, the thing that we picked up with the DJI mic and the reason why audio is important is because when you have compelling visuals, you want the audio to be equally as good. And in this case, you'll look at the DJI mic setup and it comes in a charging case, which you could then use to mic your talent and it comes with two microphones and one receiver. So wherever you go, you'll maintain the same level of audio. And the good thing about it is you can use it for your cell phone as well. Whether that be Android, or iOS device, works for both. So you can always have good audio no matter what you're doing or what you're using to shoot, you're good to go. And I tested it out, um, it's awesome. Like really good results. So if you rock with us, you'll see some of our videos in the future and you can just kind of make that decision for yourself if that's something that you want to buy. But for me, I highly recommend it. Uh, one thing to think about is the fact that you could probably clip this to your clothing and as you see today I kind of got somewhat of a light shirt on today and it'll probably drag down my shirt But I can kind of show you Kind of show you what that would look like and it's also got a magnet But if you're wearing something like what I have on today, that's not gonna work So you also have an option To use a lav mic. So the lavalier mic is good Because you can take the lav mic and you can pin it to your clothing and it's not as noticeable so you got a lot of flexibility with this system. Um, I think it's dope. But anyway, 
Thank you for tuning in. We appreciate it. Like when I said, we really appreciate it. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. We're trying to create a community here. So that way you guys can come check us out. Leave comments if you got any questions or concerns. You can leave the comments and questions below and we'll be sure to answer that for you. But hey, we're creating a movement and a brand here, trying to create a community of good people and we would like you to join us. But till next time, peace.